Hey, I'm Darren, and that's my air quality kite. It's for a project I'm working on called Float Beijing with my partner, who's already there. That's Xiao Wei. She's currently in Beijing. Float Beijing came from the need to engage the local communities of Beijing in the dialogue on urban health and pollution. We use the power of citizen science and grassroots mapping to show that motions for policy change can come from critically engaged local residents. Our project uses air quality modules composed from widely available Arduino technology and sensors. A series of workshops shows residents how to put the modules together and mount them onto kites. The kites are used in a group flight to create a stunning visual display in the night sky with LED lights indicating air quality. While there's been a lot of recent media attention given to air quality reports in Beijing, they're on sites that are blocked by the Chinese government to local residents. The U.S. Embassy reports are seen as direct criticism from the U.S. towards China, which insists that the U.S. should readjust its scale to take into account the fact that China is a developing country and has lower standards than the U.S. We received a grant from the Black Rock Arts Foundation to cover some of the materials for the workshops, but we need your support to make sure the workshops can be accessible to as wide an audience as possible, as well as supporting documentation and visualizations for sharing the project with other Beijingers.